Hello, my name is Dominic Poster, and I am happy to present on behalf of my colleagues our work entitled A Large Scale Time Synchronized Visible and Thermal Face Dataset. Uh, this was a collaborative project between the U.S. Army Army Research Lab, Booz Allen Hamilton, West Virginia University, Johns Hopkins University, and University of Lincoln, Nebraska. Thermal infrared sensors detect naturally emitted body heat. When used to capture the face, this technology has applications in military and law enforcement for nighttime and low light face recognition, but also in healthcare to detect heart rates or anxiety. In order to meet the research needs of those areas, we would like to present the Army Research Lab Visible Thermal Face Dataset, or ARLVTF for short. It is a large scale data set with 395 subjects, and it is a multimodal data set captured using a high resolution long wave infrared thermal sensor, as well as three visible wavelength cameras, two of which were set up in stereo. The subjects were captured displaying variations in expression and pose, as well as with some subjects wearing glasses. all of the cameras recorded in a time-synchronized fashion. And the data set comes with extensive metadata and annotations, as well as predefined protocols for thermal to visible face verification. And in this paper, we present benchmark results for thermal face landmark detection and thermal to visible face verification. To the best of our knowledge, the ARL BTF dataset has the most number of subjects compared to existing datasets to date. And among those datasets that have high resolution thermal sensors, uh, the ARL BTF dataset is the only one which features paired and synchronized thermal and visible data with also an extensive set of variations. Here we can see the collection area as well as the sensor array and some details about those sensors. Face and landmark detection was conducted in a semi-supervised fashion utilizing our 3D calibrations. Subjects were captured in three separate sequences, a neutral baseline, expressions elicited by having the subject count and pose, as well as a optional fourth sequence if the subject wore glasses. In order to facilitate reproducibility and evaluation, we provide a standard protocol for thermal to visible face verification. The sets are subject disjoint with the development set utilizing a fivefold cross validation scheme. Using that same protocol, we provide benchmark results for thermal face landmark detection using the Deep Alignment Network. The results are presented in terms of the normalized root mean squared error and the cumulative error distribution curve. We can see here that the pose sequence in particular is very challenging, especially as the angle of the head relative to the camera approaches plus or minus 90 degrees. The face verification benchmarks compare four different algorithms, uh, all recent and state-of-the-art, three of which are based on generative adversarial networks to synthesize a visible image from a thermal image, while the fourth learns a domain invariant feature extractor. As in on the landmark detection results, the performance drops considerably on the post sequence of images the last rows in each section of the table match visible probe images to the visible gallery in order to establish a kind of best case scenario. Finally, a quick thank you to DIFPA, IARPA, and JHU APL for making the collection possible. If you would like to request the data set, please email my colleague at the address provided here. Thank you.